Oh man, y'all. felt this rough in a very long time and I know it's because I just did a 6 45 p.m. class and now it is 4 35 a.m. and I haven't fully had time to really recover I will never do that again I didn't have a choice I literally didn't have a choice this time I mean the things we do for, for sure am I right I just I just feel like poop all over it was very hard for me to get out of bed this morning. I don't know, maybe this is like the, the little hump, you know, in between all these days. And am I just ready to get this over with and get this stinking shirt and rest? <laughs> and I still have two more days of this. I'm gonna go in and get myself together and I will see you guys after. That was terrible. I struggled <clears throat> through that entire workout. I felt like, weights were on my legs and it was just like impossible to move them. I got zero splat points and I only burned like, I don't know, like 300 and something calories. <laughs> I mean, I did try. I didn't push myself super hard because my legs were just literally killing, like not literally killing me. They were really hurting from yesterday and I still have two days of this back to back. So I took it a little easier today because of all the incline. I still worked hard. Um, I just didn't push myself like to my limits like I usually do um, but I will see you tomorrow for what is it psycho I think it's called psycho tomorrow maybe maybe I'm wrong I don't know okay I don't know where I left off I took my orange theory class this morning at 5 a.m. it was misery the first place that I wanted to go after work was to the grocery store to get me some of this <laughs> Epsom salt for aches and pains. I am literally walking around like I am a 80 year old woman. All right, so I wanted, oh, I need to be quiet. My son is asleep in the room right there. I wanted to show you guys really quickly. I'm about to go get my bath. I'm gonna go soak in an Epsom salt bath and I am so excited for that. But I haven't eaten dinner and I wanted to show you guys these things that I bought at um, Walmart. So they're called, power bowls the one that i'm eating tonight is the cuban inspired pork um it's got 20 grams of protein and 7 grams of fiber 340 calories i think it looks pretty darn delicious i don't typically eat like microwavable meals because i just kind of feel like it's hard to find some one that are good and two that are good for you but i mean this seems like it's pretty good, so I'll let you know how it is, but I'm gonna eat this and then go soak in the bath. Get to bed because I have 4 a.m. orange theory class. It's day four for me tomorrow. This is gonna be a combined vlog, so today was day three, tomorrow is day four, and I'll see you guys in the morning. All right, let's go. Here's the thing. Um, let me just put you there. Too cold and windy to be talking to you guys outside of my car. So here you go again with another car chat. I hope you enjoy it. Basically, my shins and my calves want nothing to do with anything anymore. They're done. They're like, you've overworked me. I tried to tell you and now I'm not gonna give anything to you. That is where I'm at right now. I'm gonna do another Epsom salt bath tonight and then I'm gonna get some of my oils and just give a, the biggest massage on my legs that I've ever given and hope that tomorrow it just miraculously is better because tomorrow is the last day of hell week. It is my day five and I get my shirt tomorrow. It's Halloween tomorrow. I'm so excited. So I just want to end on a bang, on a bang. Tonight, the plan is to find a costume to wear to Orange Theory tomorrow. I have no costumes in my house, so I have no idea what I'm gonna dress up as, but I want to dress up. I want to be that person. So we'll see. We'll see how it goes. I'm gonna bring you guys along with me to try to figure out what in the heck I'm gonna wear. So, all right, I will see you in just a little bit. Well, actually, I will see you in just a little bit, but you will see me right now. Hello. So you just saw me in the car and then I didn't vlog the rest of the time 
because sometimes my life is boring you guys and I just don't really think that you're gonna be interested in seeing me play with my son and fix us dinner and <laughs> keep telling him no every five seconds. But I did want to end the vlog here and I did want to say that I got a costume for tomorrow. Um, a friend of mine from work is going to lend me a mask <laughs> to wear tomorrow. And I am like super pumped to actually dress up for something for once. Um, I don't typically do stuff like this, but you know, you gotta do what you gotta do. And I wanna be, you know, the, the fun grace that not a lot of people get to see. I'm gonna get a shirt all together to go with it. And I don't know if I'm gonna wear it during the entire class tomorrow. I kinda want to just to see if I can do it, but I think it's gonna be pretty difficult to wear a mask in class. You'll probably see my Halloween uh, video, my day five of Hell Week on Friday instead of tomorrow because you're seeing this video. Um, but I'm excited for you guys to see. I'm sure if you follow me on Instagram, you're already going to see what I dressed up as um, and how it went. I get my Hell Week shirt tomorrow, I'm so excited. I love seeing all of you guys who got your shirts already. Um, I'm super proud of you guys. It was not easy. <sighs> it was not easy, but we did it. We conquered Hell Week, well, you all conquered Hell Week. I haven't yet, technically. <laughs> I'm going to in just a few hours. I will see you guys tomorrow. Thank you so much for watching. This has been fun to do this almost every day for you guys. Um, but yeah, subscribe. I'll see you tomorrow. Bye. I wake up, flex, thumb down that check. No drip this, wet. tell them run it up. No sleep, no rest. Might crash, might wreck. But first die, stretch, tell them run it up. I wake up, flex, thumb down that check. No drip this, wet. tell them run it up.